welcome to this week's vlog, uh, studio vlog. Um, so I'm just going to show you, I got some things from um, a jewelry shop. Um, so I got some little eyelet things, some little clasps, um, and just some other little bits and pieces for my um, dragon claw necklace. Uh, some chain, uh, some other bits and pieces. So I haven't finished painting them yet, but I've gotten sort of halfway through painting them. Um, so we have the three colours here. Uh, so they obviously need more paint and the nails need to be done. Um, so I don't know if you can tell who they're inspired by. Um, so yeah, they need a, a couple more things and some... Um, eyelets drilled into them. Um, I baked my Tasmanian tiger head so that's ready to go. Um, so that's sort of all I've done so far. Today is Tuesday. Yesterday was a public holiday in Australia or well in Melbourne I think. Um, so I didn't really get any work done. Uh, so today, I don't have much work because I just got home from my actual job. Um, so I'm going to see if I can take some pictures of my stag that you saw in my previous studio vlog. And um, uh, see if I can get some painting done on some things and maybe attach um, some of my eyelet things to the pendants. Um, I don't think I'll get any painting done on my dragon heads because I don't have a lot of time today. Um, but maybe I'll get some editing done on um, the stag video and see how it goes. So I'll keep you updated. today Wednesday uh, so yesterday I only just took some pictures of the stag I have for sale um, not for sale um, the stag that I have made so I took some pictures of that um, I edited them and I edited some of my um, video for that stag so that's all I really got done um, yesterday night uh, so I'm home from work again today, got my jammy jams on um, and I'm going to finish off the rest of that video for the stag um, and then what else? And then I guess we'll just see where I'm at. Um, I might drill the holes for those dragon pendants um, but I don't really have much time today either so tomorrow, Thursday is kind of my, my proper working on my art day. And, um, <laughs> and, um, all right, we all good? We're set up? Good job. Um, so yeah, tomorrow is my, um, pretty much working solidly day. Um, I work half a day on Thursdays and I usually have Friday off. Um, what are you doing? So, yeah, the next couple of days I will be able to do some work. So the plan is to um, yeah, finish off the video and see where I'm at after that. So I've only got the voiceover to do and um, wrestle with my cat. She won't leave me alone. <laughs> and um, yeah, so I'll keep you updated. <laughs>
hour of wrestling my cats off the desk. So uh, I managed to do up some chains for my pendants. I also drilled some holes and attached some hooks onto the top of the dragon pendants. Um, I haven't attached the chains just yet just because I want to finish painting these claws so I will do that tomorrow so they'll be finished and probably ready in my shop next week hopefully um, so I kind of cut up color coded them so the three colors go with the three different dragon colors I guess um, and then I also finished off my video for the stag that you saw so that's ready to be uploaded and it should be up well, you'll see this next week, so it would already be up on my YouTube, um, so you can check that out if you haven't. And that's probably it for me today, um, and I'll catch up with you tomorrow afternoon. <laughs> today is Thursday, just got home from work, um, got my lunch which is Vegemite toast, so fight me, uh, and my cup of tea, so I'm going to have a quick lunch, um, and then I'm going to finish off my um, pendants, I'm going to finish them today, I will finish them today, um, I'm going to do some work on the Tasmanian tiger, so I hope to cut the body out today and get some of his face painted, um, and I also hope to do some at least get some base coats of paint onto my dragon heads um, and oh, so that's the plan for today um, what else so I'm, yeah okay I'm just gonna finish my lunch and then um, I'll see you back afternoon or night really it's about 6 30 um so i got a lot done today i managed to put some base coats for all of my dragon heads so this will be one it's not all done but it's it's just a base coat um <clears throat> and then we have another one <clears throat> so i still got the mouth to do and then the one with the mouth closed so these are just the base coats um, I still have to color in the horns for this one <clears throat> and I'll probably do that tomorrow or something if I have some time um, so let's put those down um, I cut out and sewed up the body for the Tasmanian tiger, so that'll be ready to put together tomorrow. Um, <clears throat> I also started painting up the bits for the Tasmanian tiger as well, so that's ready to go. And then um, I finished off... Um, 
have to attach this one this one again um, <clears throat> but I finished off the pendants so I'll reattach this one um, I don't think I put enough glue in it but um, I'll just reattach that one tomorrow and then I have to um, package a art piece that I got from an Australian artist called Malame and I got this sculpture a couple of years ago now and it was something that I always wanted and I got for my birthday a couple of years ago um, and then my cats got to it so um, they chewed them out a bit I don't know if you can see what they've done to her little face. This is the worst. They chewed her ear. They chewed the other ear off. And they chewed the feet. So, I wasn't very happy with them, but... What are they... They don't know. But anyway... So I emailed her and asked her if she could fix it um, and she can kind of just get the the grazes, the big gash in, in her face, she can get that off but there will be some scarring but that's okay because um, at least it's still a sculpture from her and I don't mind if there's some scarring because it kind of tells a story. Um, but I'll be commissioning her again for another one. Um, they're called Echoes, if you don't know. And, um, yeah, so I'll be commissioning her again for another one. I put a deposit down. Um, and it will be my cat that I lost in June last year. Um, it will be based on her, so it'll be somewhat like a little spirit. Um in an echo form. So I'm gonna uh, wrap that, package it up and send her off tomorrow to Tasmania um, but I'm just glad she can kind of get the gash fixed up a little bit even if it's gonna leave some scarring but as long as it looks kind of whole again. Um, and I also did a little watercolour just for a little break um, so we have a kind of like an autumn forest so I want to do a couple more of these and then release it as like a set um, like an autumn set with maybe a sticker sheet or something um, like a misty misty mountain sticker set or something um, or autumn mist something like that um, so I'll do a couple more I quite like doing these and I, I really like watercolor it's kind of relaxing even though I don't really know what I'm doing but hey, that's how you learn. Um, so that's my first one so far. Uh, so I'll do a couple more um, in the next couple of weeks and see um, how many pieces I get. Because it is autumn here, so um, perfect. Even though I think, what is it if, over and everywhere else? Not autumn. Um, yeah, so I think that is it for me today. Yeah, I think that's all I did today, which is quite a fair bit considering I only have half a day to do things, so I've only got a couple of hours. Um, so I'm going to package my little Echo to send and then I'm going to do some yoga and read some Game of Thrones. I'm on to book four, so trying to get them done before the final series start. Um, let me know if you read the books as well because I find them better than the TV show um, for some reason. I just think they're a bit more put together. It's not so like shock tactic if that makes sense. Um, it flows a bit better and it goes into depth a bit more. So let me know in the comments if you watch Game of Thrones or read the books or anything. So I'm on to book four, halfway through book four now. So I've got a couple more to go, so I'm going to do that and then just relax with my cats on the couch. 
and then I'll be back tomorrow to do some more work. Bye! Today is Friday about 4 o'clock in the afternoon. Uh, I just got home from doing some shopping and lunch and stuff. Um, so I got a little bit done. I uh, painted the rest of one of the dragons, so that's drying now. Painted some the like the base colour of the eyes down. Um, so I'm going to let, let that dry before I do anything else. Um, made the armature for the Tasmanian tiger uh, doll that I've been working on. So that is that has to dry, so it will take 24 hours to dry. So I probably won't get to work on it until next week. Um, painted in that one. Eyes. Fur everywhere. Um, and then painted up some green eyes as well. So getting there slowly. There's a lot of waiting to wait for things to dry um, with painting. So really, really boring. Um, got the body ready to be sewn up. Like I said, just waiting for the armature to dry so I can move it around and stuff. Um, so that's probably it that I'm going to do. Um, I'm going to make some more paintings like I showed you before. Um, and then with the sticker set, I kind of want to make um, like a pine tree collection. So this is the sticker set that I made, um, which is in my shop at creaturesofnap.com. So it's a sticker set that I made. It's a winter sticker set. Um, but I kind of want to make like individual little palm, uh, pine trees like that for the next release that I'm thinking of doing. Um, so that we like die cut stickers so it'll just be like the outline of it. So I'm thinking of doing that to go along with my watercolours that I'm going to do. Um, so I don't know when I'm going to do that at some point, not sure. Um, and that's pretty much it. I'm going to edit this vlog and then get it ready to upload next week. Um, and then I'll probably just, again, do some yoga and have some dinner. Um, and that's it. So, probably going to sign off for today. So, I'll see you next week. Bye!